tasting a Sauvignon Blanc, a popular wine amongst beginners. I have here a 2018 De La Rougerie. It's a product of France, which is where the Sauvignon Blanc originated from. The Sauvignon Blanc has made its home in two regions in France. One is the Bordeaux, which is in the southwest region, and the other is the Loire Valley in the central part of France. It's a very popular wine grown in various countries, including France, Italy, Spain, New Zealand, US, South Africa, Chile, Brazil, and Australia. An interesting fact about this wine, Sauvignon derived from the French term sauvage, meaning savage or wild, and it is probably a description of the wild vines found from early settlers in France. The first thing you'll notice about this wine is its light and bright color. It's a very light yellow color compared to many other white wines. If you hold a white piece of paper behind the wine, you'll see the color a little more clearly and you'll be able to distinguish this white wine amongst others by looking at the different hues of yellow in the wine. Next we can go ahead and swirl the wine, helping it breathe and release the complex aromas. The Sauvignon Blanc grows very well in cooler climates, as well as warmer climates, but each type will give its wine a completely different tasting profile. If you notice that you have a wine grown in a cooler climate, you'll notice very pleasant scents of freshly cut grass, some herbaceous notes, and grapefruit. But an unpleasant smell that some people report is cat pee, so it can be a very distinguishing scent from other white wines. If you have a wine that's grown in warmer parts of the world, you'll smell more fruity notes such as pineapple, white peaches, and green apple. When tasting this wine, you're gonna notice flavors such as kiwi, green apple, lime, white peaches, passion fruit, and perhaps a little bit of that herbaceous flavor that I mentioned earlier. When I taste this wine, I notice some tartness and a very crisp flavor. Sauvignon Blanc is a very popular wine because of its refreshing taste, and it's especially great during a warm day, so I definitely recommend cooling this wine for as long as you can. You'll also notice very high acidity in this wine, which contributes to its refreshing crisp taste that is so familiar with a Sauvignon Blanc. A big question I get is what does this pair well with? And because of its acidic nature, it pairs super well with cheeses such as goat and parmesan. It's delicious with leafy salads, any type of seafood, as well as Brussels sprouts and asparagus. Fun fact, asparagus is actually a very difficult vegetable to pair wine with, but it goes excellent with Sauvignon Blanc. So if you're looking for something to pair it with, you have found a winner. If you like this wine, hit the like button below and let me know in the comments what you think about the Sauvignon Blanc. And if you're looking for a red wine instead, something delicious and unique, click the video here. Thank you guys for tuning in. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.